So we've managed to find a bunker. Now you'll all know that you can't ground your club in a bunker. So you've got to have that club hovering above the ball. You can't touch the sand. But nowhere in the rules does it say that you can't touch the sand in a different bunker. So if you've got a bunker at the side and you've not had a warm up, you've not practiced your bunker play out, you know, before you teed off and the sand today it's very wet. So I'm not sure how this sand's going to react. I can actually just have a practice swing and ground my club to see what that feels like. And I can assure you, I weren't expecting it to feel that good. It actually glides through nice and easily. Well, maybe I should have had a couple more practice swings, but I hope you've learned something there about having a practice swing and testing the sand, not in the bunker you're playing and taking a penalty, but the one at the side, if you've got time, 